All right, so it's been a while um, since I last played this, but we're going to continue this today, as I think I can be semi-competent at reading. Um, okay, so we're reuniting these two tribes, I think. What is this? River horse. Oh, using seahorse in a drink? That's interesting. Oh, that's a classic. I have to get those. Um, but yeah, things are alright. I'm just a bit busy today. This new Japanese retail outlet opened nearby. I might go give it a look over the weekend. Um, but they sell indoor sandals there, which kind of got my attention. They look highly comfortable. Boss Strad says I have to wait until I'm a grown-up. Strad? Now, Chief, he's at the end of this path. He said that playing music is a sacred duty. Little minnows like me can only watch. I hope this isn't about to become a rhythm game. <laughs> Just... Oh man, Oracle of Seasons and Oracle of Ages, their little dancing minigame. Our people are scared, boss. That huge rift opening. Lord Jabu Jabu on the rampage. Fear not, I have a plan. When I... When have I, the great... Rad, ever let you down. First, I'll get Lord Jabu Jabu nice and relaxed again. Good thinking, boss, but how will you do that? With music, of course. River music. That'll stop his rampage. We're just that good. Then that no talent Kushara will finally bow down to my superior skills. Ha. <laughs> Hold on, boss. Why are you squabbling with the Caesar chief? You two usually make up right away. It's really dragging on this time. Squabbling? This is a big deal. She mocked my music. I'll never make up with her. Bah, I'm not going to just sit around. I've got real problems to deal with in Nawa. Who are you? Heh, <laughs> doesn't matter. Uh, it's got to wait. Did you need a chief for something? Sorry, Drad is busy. The boss has got a lot going on right now. Doesn't help that he's having the worst squabble ever with the Caesar chief. Their fights usually are small, then just fizzle out. This time it's blown up completely. They used to get along so well. Yeah, this fight's gotten really bad. Nah, no, what's the hold up? We've got to get to Crossflow's Plaza. Coming. Sorry, the boss calls. See ya. Squabble, what a strange word. I don't understand what it means. But I do know that we'll never reach that rift until the two chiefs hear out our request. This music feels very Breath of the Wild. Or Tears of the Kingdom. I don't know. Like a, I mean, it's village music. I think it's, it's the horns that do it. Wait, what is this? Oh. All these rifts everywhere. I just want to... Okay. When, when can I go on a good stroll again? I think I need to go to the ocean one, like, get both of them... To say that they're going to the crossroads, I get the feeling that's what it's going to be. Uh, what have I done? Okay, that's fine, I can go through here. I thought I was going to be stuck. Yeah, 
Interesting. What is this? I think this is just move it. Okay, that's straightforward enough. There's something about finding heart pieces that's just satisfying. It's something that I hope returns to 3D Zelda. Because they've just kind of done away with it. Wait, how is this one going to work? Okay, I think I got it. Or not. That's gotta be it. I just gotta be good. You know what? I'm happy about that, because I can afford the flippers now, I think. Yeah, this Japanese shop looks interesting. It almost looks like a mix of Uniqlo and, like, Daiso. Or if you don't know what Daiso is, it's just... They just sell... It's another Japanese outlet, but they just sell home goods and stuff. I keep accident. <laughs> I keep pressing the wrong button. Ugh. Swapping between two style of controllers, like, it, it takes a minute to adjust. Ah. The thing is, I don't think they're a hard requirement, they just help. Like... So I'm wearing something that makes heart hearts appear more. It feels like they haven't really appeared much. So that entire time I was wearing something that helped hearts appear and it still felt like hearts weren't appearing. <laughs> You're not allowed to go shopping, you spend too much. You went for butter and came home with sticks that smell like cinnamon. <laughs> I thought you were like uh, cinnamon sticks at first. I'm like, oh, but you can cook with that. Then I realized, wait, no, sticks that smell like cinnamon. No, I mean I'm I'm pretty procedural when it comes to shopping. It's like I'll if I need to go find something, I will go find that thing, and that's it. It's like in and out. I'm on a mission. I just don't like how crowded shopping centers get. But sometimes with stuff like, uh... 
Like if something new opens up and, you know, I could use some new clothes or something like that. It's like, alright, I don't necessarily know what I want, but I can, I can browse. So it's not all like that. I keep doing it, I keep doing it. B is cancel, not A. Am I okay to be in here? Okay, that's fine. This is nice. Welcome to the Caesar village at Underwater Paradise, new to the Jabul water area. We're the Caesar, the Zora that make our home out here in the waves. Kelp. Very nice looking area. It smells like a craft store now. <laughs> I mean, that sort of stuff is fine. It's like, it makes a house smell okay, as long as you don't have excessive amounts of it. This is a grave situation. First, that rift. Now, Lord Jabu Jabu is going wild. Lord Jabu Jabu is the spirit of all Zora, but it falls to us to calm him down. This crisis is without equal, and now it's time that I, Kashara of the Sea Zora, resolve it. Chief, what inspiring words. Please tell me how you plan to do it. Lord Jabu Jabu loves our sea music, so I need only get him to listen to us perform. And then Drad, that tuneless buffoon, will have to applaud my performance. I take it you haven't resolved your latest quarrel with the other chief yet. And why would I? This quarrel is one for the ages. I will never speak to him again. <laughs> he insulted my music. I will not tolerate his presence. It's like he lives to provoke me. Oh, we'd be fine if he agreed that I was more talented. <sighs> Never mind all that. We have to leave immediately, Rogma. Mm -hmm. oh, greetings, Hylian. I'm on my way out. Your business will need to wait. Hmm. Did you have a request of our chief? I am sorry to say that until she's resolved our problem, she won't have time to help. If our great crisis wasn't bad enough, our chief is quarreling with the River Zora chief. They often have their little quarrels, but always make up quickly. Not this time. What's the saying? A squabble a day keeps a friendship in play? Such nonsense. Well, stranger, I shouldn't burden you with our troubles. Ragma, please, we must be off to Crossflow's Plaza. Yes, at once. If you'll excuse me. They went off to Crossroads Plaza too. And I guess it's time we joined the two chiefs there as well. Yeah, I mean, one of those things lasts ages. Okay, we're ready to go back now. Wait. That's the one. It's been a while. Uh, I'm doing it again. How dare you! You shouldn't have come here. I'll take care of Lord Jabu Jabu myself. Get lost. My thoughts precisely off with you. Grumble, grumble. Hey, Kishara, you can stuff your plan. We of the Caesar will bring calm to Lord Jabu Jabu. Our music can quiet his rage. Ridiculous. We'll do it, not you. I like how derpy the one in the back left corner looks. 
Yikes, they're at it again. It was only a matter of time before those two exploded. But not here, not now. The way you play, you just enrage them more with your crude honking, so we'll play. Insults, always insults. Say more about your music than mine. But sure, let's do this. Your playing is weak. It's puny. It won't have any effect. What? Now you've done it. There are some things that you can't take back, you know. It's time to settle this. One last performance to see whose playing is superior. No problem. On the count of three, we both play. The best player wins. What, perform together in this state? My chief, with all due respect, you can't hope to put on a great performance this way. It's no use. There's no stopping them when they get like this. They just want to play together. They're just making excuses. Yeah, I mean, it's neat to see both styles in one game. I don't think they've done that before. They're usually the ones on the left are like aggressive and they attack you. That was terrible. They didn't play in time with each other. Not at all. Oh my god, what is what is this face? Lord Java Jabu. You came when you heard my performance, didn't you? How did you like it? Ha, there's no question that my playing was what brought him here. Shut up already. Huh? B boss, watch out. Chief Kashara, get back. How can this be? Gulp down, the both of them. There's no time to delay. I'll go in pursuit of Lord Jabu Jabu and rescue Rogma. No fair, no head starts. Our friends are in danger. Forget this talk of head starts. Me first. Hey, you cheater. See... Hang on, this is getting out of control and we still haven't been able to ask them what we need. They've got to open that door in the den for us, but that'll never happen at this rate. Yeah. What a mess. Hmm. Lord Jabu Jabu went upriver. Do you think he's heading toward your village? Uh. I bet you're right. Oh no, I've got a bad feeling about this. Okay. Um, see, I would have thought that the difference between the two is like one of them is a freshwater Zora. And the other one is a seawater Zora, you know? But apparently not. <laughs> it, it doesn't matter. They can swim in whatever water. Yeah, that would have made sense, but... Oh, what have I done? Yeah, it's not gonna work. Now the difference with them, between them is vague, because it used to be that one of them were, like, aggressive. There was, like, some lore that they evolved... Like the, uh... Oh, that worked. They evolved to be intelligent, and so they're not aggressive. What's that? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> I'm 
trying to crash bandicoot spin. Oh dear. I've watched other play people I've watched other people play this and um everyone has the same thoughts about this UI. It's like, could they really have not done like a better job with this? Like this is it's kinda wild that this was the best they could come up with, like just horizontally scroll everything. Yeah. Boss. Was that the River Zora Chief? It came from over there. You know, I've, I've seen split opinions about how much dialogue and explanation there is in this game. It's kind of 50 50, like. Half people don't mind it, and the other half are like, yeah, it's a bit much. I th I think it's a bit much. This will work, right? What did I- what did I just do? Oh, I've made it worse. Yeah, nice. Very smart. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the bat is funny. I find that, you know, Zelda's main... main way to navigate a map is to place beds. It's, it's pretty amusing. Ugh, my papa and Drad. That's alright, I'm here to help. We'll find your father and the chief. But this is the primary reason I haven't played it as much. It's just, there are some evenings I'm just not in the mood to read, and this has got a lot of reading. Something awful's happened here. Hmm, the Hylian, hello again. Chief Drad and I followed behind Lord Jabu Jabu as he rampaged through here. Lord Jabu Jabu wasn't himself. He struck my poor papa, who, who fell into the rift. That's when Chief Drad and I got here, only to, to uh, only to see the rift suddenly grow. Drad saved his child from being caught, but was then swallowed up himself. I can't say where Lord Jabu Jabu's gone, but Drad, oh, it's all too terrible. I can create an entrance here. Stand back, Zelda. You can sleep in it and heal. Yeah, I don't mind that ability. I just wish it would heal quicker. It heals very slowly. I can sense my friends in here. They're trapped. They're trapped in five areas to be exact. We rescue them all, we can fix this rift. You see stuff like that, where it's like, you know, in the top right corner, it shows you that there's five to rescue. And for the first one, it's like, fair enough, they explain it, but I don't know, every time we come into one of these, it has to go, hey, there's five to rescue. If we do rescue them, we can get rid of this rift, just like the other 12 times we've done this. I guess that's the thing. I don't mind reading. It's just the reading in this is a lot of just kind of explaining the already established. If it was more 
just story rating, I wouldn't mind as much. This is interesting. There he is. We'll go back to normal just like the others if we can fix this rift. It's definitely reminding me of, um, like, Paper Mario. Oh, these things. Okay, well, I guess this is how we get bombs. How do you make them blow up? Oh, I see. Treat him like a Crash Bandicoot TNT crate. That's cool, it attracts enemies like that. Hey, get him. <laughs> what happens? Support. <laughs> Holy crap. That was scary. Get him, doggo. Good job. <laughs> that was close. Cool if you could get a more comfortable bed that makes it heal quicker. I mean, maybe there is one. But see, I got the feeling that hearts don't appear in this game as often because they want you to do this to heal. And it's kind of... It's a neat novelty. It's just... I don't know, man. <laughs> it takes a while. And this is with, this is with just seven hearts. Like, I can only imagine what it's going to be like later. I guess I, ha I can use potions. There's just a free way to do this.
This is a little mean that we're using this poor fish. <laughs> like this. Just as a way to get bombs. I do that. Oh, hang on, what am I doing? We found all my friends in this area. Now we can mend this rift. It's interesting how they all have different faces. It kind of reminds me of Unknown from Pokemon. It's like, it's the same thing, but... Oh, what happened there? The capture card just reset for no reason. <laughs> Alright, man. My friends shared some of their power with me. The white screen afterwards made me worried for a sec, but that's fine. Let's go back to your world now. Me, the Volzora, swallowed up by a rift. My goodness, Drad, don't be so precious. Now, thank this Hylian. Who's calling who, precious? You with your frilly gr gills. <laughs> Boss Drad, what's wrong with my papa? Cocoon uh... in that darkness, swallowed hole, can't breathe. Ugh. Hey, what's wrong with you? Ah. It's like he's stuck back in there. Then I will unstick him. Did that help? I'm... I'm... I'm okay, thanks to you. <laughs> ha! While well, the music of the Caesar lures frantic thoughts into a deep calm. Hmm. Oh. Ooh. That performance, good as it gets. Oh. Chief Kashara, Chief Kashara. What's the matter? Uh, it's Lord Jabu Jabu, he's in Zora Cove. Uh, right then, let's go. <gasps> hey, wait for me. Whoa. Oh, almost forgot about you. Kashara oh. said you saved us. Who are you anyway? Ooh. Zelda, huh? I know I've heard that name. Ah. Well, Zelda, I owe you big thanks, but that's got to wait. I need to catch up with Kashara. I owe her big time, too. See you around. Hey, Zelda. I think we need to catch up with Kashara. There they go again. That music she played was pretty nice. She performs better by herself. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh... Oh, quest. Oh, uh, my mom's being weird. She's staring at the pool in her house, talking to herself. Something about monsters. Ah, she's going to feed me to the monsters. Wait, no, that isn't it. Still, I'm 
Joshi is very disappointed with me. I can't swim yet. Um, I'm too scared to try. Please, you've got to help me. Could you check on my mom? Yeah. Oh, my, it's Zelda, right? I've heard that you rescued those who got caught in the rifts. Maybe you'll help me with a personal matter. Could you bring me some monsters? I'm going to use them for something. Let's see. First I need... A monster that looks like a sinister fish. Please put any monsters you bring me in the water there. I'll give you something nice if you can help. Sinister fish. No. Push the kid in the water, that's a way to teach them how to swim. But that's... that, that usually works. They do that with babies, they kind of just put them in the water and instinctively they swim. Perfect. That's exactly the sinister looking fish. Monster I wanted. Hang on for, for a moment. Clonk, clonk, clonk. Hmm. This was tough enough for the job, but it's not getting it very shiny. What? It didn't work with your kid. <laughs> Thanks to the monster. Help me learn more about what I need to know. Now, can you bring me a monster that goes boom when anyone goes near it? Okay. Oh, bombfish. Those definitely go boom when you get close to them. Now, let's see. Hmm, that wasn't good enough either. It's not getting it dazzling enough. But it does have a fine shine. Looking better. Either it works or it gives them trauma. I guess that's true. Thanks for that monster. It helped me learn even more about what I need to know. Jellyfish monster. Okay. That monster is exactly what I had in mind. The way it floats is pretty. Very, very pretty. Shifting colors and patterns. Zowie? Aha! <laughs> At last, I did it. Gotta say, it turned out well too. Now, to see my son. Come with me. What is this gonna be? <laughs> Medaka? Mom, I'm not a- I'm not monster food. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, Medaka, please, just hold out your hand. Uh, a scale? Yes. One polish using a legendary technique I only know in Tesoro. With this scale, you'll be able to swim. Really? I know you're worried about not being able to swim, so I made you a special charm. You made this for me? Placebo effect. I'll give it a try. Yeah! Whoa, whoa, I can do it. I'm swimming. Well done. I always knew you could. Yay, swimming is fun. Thanks, Mom. I mean, what's what's the worst case scenario for that kid if, if it uh, can't swim? It's not like... I mean, they can breathe underwater. <laughs> Thank you for your help. I can't begin to say how much this meant to us. I'd like to thank you by giving you the same charm I made to Madaka. Zora scale. Ow. That's probably more useful than swimming quicker. I needed each of those monsters so I could research ways to polish scales. Thank you again from the bottom of my heart. There's probably a way to equip multiple charms, I just don't have it yet. Oh. I don't think my parents tried that with me, like, just throwing me into water. Maybe I just don't remember. But I mean, in Australia, you do get swim classes as part of school, so... Maybe that might be why.
They're gonna be somewhere over here. Assume they're like nearby. That was Drad, wasn't it? What's he groaning about? Ah, this is too heavy. Sewing was part of P when you were a kid. Yeah, same for me. Oh, you again, Zelda. Yeah, you can kind of tell we're in a real jam here. My son and Chief Kishara, they're both trapped in this cave. My son wandered off, and I'd just come here to find him when Lord Jabu Jabu stormed in. Chief Kishara was nearby during the confusion. He sensed my son was in the cave. He darted inside to make sure he was safe. That's when, wham, this pile of rubble fell here, smack dab in front of the cave. Uh... What am I to do? Ooh. Don't worry, keep calm, I've got this. Never met a pile of rocks I couldn't move. Mm. Easier said than done, maybe there's another way inside. He's not going to hear a word until he moves those rocks. Maybe he'll listen to us if we get the rescue done. The Zora, the creature that swims, did not occur to <laughs> look in the ocean. Uh. Oh, this is cool. about that. This jellyfish is not very useful at defending me. Okay. Hey. Get him. Give him a keys. It's okay, everything's going to be fine. Help is surely on the way. Mm. You, you promise? Mm. Hmm? Uh. You, the Hylian, did you truly manage to swim through all those monsters to reach us? Uh. Hmm, yes, quite the capable one, aren't you? <sighs> We'd hope to get through, out through there. <sighs> I can't take the child into those waters. We need another means of escape. There is an exit, but it's blocked by a pile of rocks. Can't push it or pull it. Uh, I'll never get any of hmm. I'm sorry to ask, but is there anything you can do to help? Yep. Oh. 
Oh, the rocks, dude. <laughs> uh, I don't want to be very negative about this game, but... You moved that pile of rocks, now we might be able to leave this place. What's your name, Hylian? Zelda, mm. that sounds familiar. Well, you have my thanks. <laughs> Let's get in there and save your kid. Yes, please. My son, you're safe. What a relief. Drad, what are you doing here? Just paying you back for saving my friend. Wait, Zelda, when did you get here? You're alright, son. Look, we can easily go outside now. You're safe, child. There's nothing to be afraid of. The poor kid's frozen to the fins. Too scared for words. How's that? Wow, much better. Thank you. That <laughs> Revisora music is pure oomph. It'll get anyone's fins and back in fighting form. Haha, <sighs> -ha, your sound was superior. I'll admit it, Drad, that performance was magnificent. Who could have guessed that your music could help one of my people? Don't forget, you helped one of mine too, just repaying a debt. I didn't get a chance to say it, but the way you played was great, in order to hear it. Well, you know, it was nothing, really. This is kind of awkward, isn't it? We never trade compliments. <laughs> now kiss. Every now and then, Rad. How about we put our squabbles aside and try to help each other out? <laughs> I was about to say the same thing. <laughs> then we're agreed. And when you and I work together, we're a strong tide that lifts all. Mm. What's that? You need us to perform at Lord Jabu Jabu's den. Your name was Zelda, yes? We're indebted to you, but we must focus on finding Lord Jabu Jabu. Zelda might have the right idea, though, going to his den. Mm? Oh, really? Oh. I saw Lord Jabu Jabu swim back north while you were stuck in here. Could be that he's gotten tired out after his rampage and gone back to his den. Mm. That would make sense. Lord Jabu Jabu rarely moves around this much. Huh? We'll grant you a request. Let's be on our way immediately. <laughs> we'll meet you at uh, Lord Jabu Jabu's den. Hey, Zelda, I think we need to go to Lord Jabu Jabu's den. Uh. Thank you for saving my boy. We wish you well on your travels. <laughs> Thanks, Zelda. Okay, I didn't do it. <laughs> yep. Damn it, I clicked the, uh... I guess I went inside. What's that? Ooh. Oh, Zelda. <laughs> Lord Jabu Jabu did return here. Mm. You've got to get through this door, right? We normally perform here to open the way, but it's not so simple now. Mm. One of the altars upon which we perform is broken, likely by Lord Jabu Jabu. We can't play together until it's repaired. Mm. And both have rubble on them. We have to get the altars ready for us, but how? Mm. First things first, I suppose clearing the rubble seems like the easy part.
Ah, we can perform now. You helped us yet again, Zelda. We need a little time to set up. You just sit tight and enjoy. This is nice. Phew. The way they played at Crossroads Plaza wasn't anything like that. Why'd it sound so different? Playing in time with each other, who knew that'd be so fun? Kushara, you were fantastic. Oh ho, you weren't half bad either, Drad. Playing in time with each other. I don't get it. They played together last time too, what changed now? But they seem pretty happy. Drad, I'd like to apologize, I behaved terribly. I hope you can forgive me. Ishara. Uh. I feel the same. Sorry for everything. Hi. We didn't mean to hold you up, Zelda. The door is now open. We'd never have gotten this far without you. We owe you big time. Uh. Let's go in and see jo Lord Jabu Jabu. Yes, together. Lord Jabu Jabu, we ask that you return our friends to us, please. Our friends are very dear to us. Oh, I have an idea. I bet we'd get him in a better mood if we perform like we did earlier. Then let us play our best. Right. He's still angry? That doesn't make sense. Something a little off here. A little, things have been a lot off since he started acting wild. The way that big fish looks, Zelda, it's got to be another imposter from a rift. An imposter? Huh, now that you mention that, that would explain everything. You said anything about an imposter? That round thing next to Zelda thinks that. Oh, right. Drad has been in the rift, he can see me now. Well, I have no idea who you're talking about, but, well, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> Let's show this fake fish you can't mess with the Zora. And I bet giving it a good thumping will fix all our problems too. Ooh. A fine plan, Drad. Let's all dive on in then. <laughs> Alright, we're right behind you. Let's go. Typical. Gah! Oh, what's this? We're cut off from Zelda. I can make an entrance into the rift directly behind that big fish, but not until that creature is out of the way. That didn't work. Oh, yes, it did. This is like the Dodongo fight. Classic Dodongo fight.
Should have worked, right? Get him. Getting trickier. Oh, rampage. Oh, it didn't work. I'm surprised I can't learn the boat as an echo. I found that amusing. Style points. <laughs> Boss, that was terrifying. No, I'm sorry. Sorry for all of this. Uh. I'm sorry too, Rogma. All of this because you leapt to my defense. Seeing you say brings me great joy. Think nothing of it. Mm. Hey boss, looks like you and Kashara patched things up. Ooh. Boy, you missed a lot, didn't you? We ended up helping each other out. Huh? We couldn't have done it without Zelda here. Ooh. That's amazing. Way to go. Ooh. Yes, delightful. How fortunate that we were gulped down by Lord Jabu Jabu. <laughs> <laughs> But if this Lord Jabu Jabu was an imposter, where in the world is the real one? Hmm, I'm sure he's been swallowed by the rift. <laughs> Ugh, the rift, huh? Then there's not much we can do. But hold on. You saved me, Zelda. Can you rescue Lord Jabu Jabu? Uh... You seem to be our last hope. Please save him if you can. Thank you. 
This is cool. Whoa. I mean, the dungeons are original. I don't, I don't even know if you can call these dungeons, but... Ooh. Just the process of traversing this stuff is neat. Damn it. Oh, come on, that didn't work. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Idiots. I could have had that sooner. Interesting. How's this gonna work? Okay, it has to be connected to water. You can't just summon it in the air! <laughs> Oops. It's pretty neat. Oh. Wow. <laughs> That's a pretty cool mechanic. I like how that works. Okay. Oh. Dude, this analog stick is driving me nuts. It's okay though, Nintendo assures us controllers aren't... Controllers drifting aren't a widespread issue. that why is that there why would I want to do this what 
weird. What? Hmm. Oh, okay. Say while well, this is here now. <laughs> Damn it. I'm not even sure if I'm headed in the right direction. <laughs> I'm kind of just... I'm just climbing. <laughs> Protect me, P-Hat. That works too. Oh, there, there it is. Is more aggressive. I was trying to be funny. Who is that in the background? I'm probably gonna make this thumbnail. <laughs> uh. Isn't this one of the people we were looking for? He'll be restored to normal once we take care of this rift. Willy? Man. Good thing you pointed it out. I sense my friends up ahead. Are you alright? I guess you can't go back up here, can you, Zelda? Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh boy. It's gonna be a lot of this. Guessing you're not a friend. What are they doing? Oh, okay. Damn it. The Zora scale's coming in more handy. The thing about the one about being able to breathe longer, most of the time it puts one of those bubble things, so it's not as necessary. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> the water, water dungeons. They're usually very long. I wonder if there's anything here. Hmm, doesn't look it. Another statue thing? Oh, this looks intricate. This is definitely giving me Ocarina of Time vibes. Or at least the 3DS version. Follow the red line or the colored lines. having those same feelings again. It's not a very smart fish. Whoa. <laughs> Hold on. Say something here. that work? No, okay, never mind.
I don't think there's any need. I guess I've stopped doing the whole thing where there's heart pieces inside the dungeons. But I feel like that was half the fun of chests is like, you never knew when one of them was going to be a heart piece or like an item that helped you progress. Now it's kind of like, well, it's going to be money or one of the cooking ingredients, which isn't as cool. What is this? Interesting. Can't seem to get it out. Okay, hang on. God, it's spreading. Stop! Stop spreading! <laughs> okay. That was very intelligent of me. Mm. Oh, it worked. I feel like that was probably an easier way to do that. Oh, you know what? I think I know what it is. The water block. The water block would have been the way to do that. I didn't even consider that. Interesting how I can't learn or move them. Doesn't seem to be white activated. Summon. Come here. Just remain calm. It's fine. Get 
two for one. Nice. Well, this one should be more useful. It's probably the most aggressive water enemy that I got. Right, you can throw stuff. What did the other one? What did? Why did this? What? What am, what am I doing? Okay, <laughs> somehow that worked. I don't know how that worked. I'm sure I can climb across that. <laughs> so weird. Shock is very useful. Just let me straight up get up there. I probably could have climbed up there. I don't want to try, but it was probably way up there sooner. Oh, it doesn't let me pull it up because of the rock. Oh, there we go. It floats without the rock on it. Oh, 
Oh. <laughs> that also works. I didn't even consider that. Out of my way, I want it. Okay, that hurts. <laughs> this looks like I'm waiting to be rescued, the way the lights are shining down. Supply. Thank you. Oh, boy. Go away. Hey, Mrs. Sam, what's up? Consume. Yes, long time. How's things? Get him. I'll just keep re-summoning it. Hey! You're just playing this collecting stamps. How are you finding the game? I'm enjoying it, but I, ha I have my critiques of it. Yeah, that's that's a fun game overall. The only thing that I could do with that is like it it just explains a lot, like how Paper Mario did, um, Origami King. There's a lot of start, stop, start, stop, start, stop. But other than that, it's fun. Never notice you don't rage much. Yeah, that's fair. I've I've definitely noticed it.
but there's a, uh... It just feels like a tutorial a lot. Like, on the same level of... Well, maybe not as bad as Skyward Sword, but... Like, it just... I just got reminded of it, just... Yeah, I know. Reading is for nerds. I, I don't mind it if it's story related, but half the time it's just to explain something that has already been explained before. I get it, kids are gonna play this, but, at, you know, at the same time I was a kid once and I didn't need things, you know, to be explained that much. Sun. It's not sticking, it's because it's a river. Alright, I'm just gonna try and climb it. That should stop that one. There we go. Reading is your job, you quit teaching. Oh. I didn't know that. Just because something is your job doesn't mean you have to enjoy it all the, or do it all the time. It's not working because of the current. Wait, why did why did that work? Okay. Oh, invisible ceiling chat. It doesn't let me climb any higher. Whatever. Well, I guess it's not invisible. It's the actual ceiling and you just can't see it. Not allowed. I can't believe some of the things I'm doing. I don't get how this water block works. Like, sometimes it's fine, and other times it's not. What? See, why did, why did it work there? I don't get what I did to make it work. <laughs> like... I don't want to drop down. Um... Oh, okay. <laughs> These abominations I'm making that work. Why is that working? Okay. Okay. <laughs> no, no, I'll, I'll do it myself. I've, I've got my methods. 
Don't you worry about me, I'll... I'll get through this. Why? I love how it just snaps back into place, like not allowed. Stop. There's clearly like a grid system. <laughs> okay. And now I can let loose this thing. This is more effort than what it could have been. Oh, this one's already gone. But I'm having fun. <laughs> Just doing dumb things with the mechanics. Get him, doggle. <laughs> oh, that's so unfortunate when it drowns. Why can't they swim? That... They should be able to swim. The dog paddle, come on. There's a swimming technique named after them. Well, this was, uh, this was long. Not as involved as I thought it was going to be. The moment I got here, I just got Water Temple vibes just because of the lines. Th this wasn't too bad. There wasn't backtracking. It's pretty linear. Dark in here. Oh, this thing. Yeah, no, it was definitely way easier than Water Temple. Just the vibes I was getting from it just reminded me of the 3DS Water Temple, where you had to follow the colored, colored lines to get to the uh, water level you needed to rise. But it wasn't that, so. I see. Or not. <laughs> okay, so that's the armored part. Thank you. 
Hey, do it correctly. I don't know why it's going lower. Dude, what are you doing? <laughs> go, go through it. What on earth? Water block? Get him. I think the thing that definitely made me feel old was like reading that people aren't using the term Google anymore as a way to search for things and younger people are just using the term search. Because no one really uses Google <laughs> for search anymore. Like, it's all TikTok and short form content and that sort of thing. So, like, Google has become a thing that's used by older people. Why are you moving back? Down here. up fish my friends shared some of their power with me
I feel like I can do even more now. Oh, reduce the casting cost. I should probably go upgrade. I haven't done that in a while. That's something for my friends while mending the rift. They told me that this was the largest rift they've ever mended. None of us realized that rifts could get big like this if we're unable to do our job. It's hard to say what would have happened if you hadn't defeated that monster, Zelda. There's not really anything else to do in the still world for now. So let's go back to your world. I didn't really explore this area out. <laughs> Don't forget the heart. At least it's not step over the portal and it, it teleports you out. It asks you if you want to leave. Now oh, Zelda's back. Zelda, you're amazing. You got rid of all the rifts. What about Lord Jabu Jabu? That big fish in the still world. With the rift gone, I'm sure he's fully back to normal. Oh. Really? At long last. <laughs> Thank you, Zelda. Uh. You know, Drad and I are more alike than not. We're close in age. We care for our villagers. Mm. Yet we squabble. Maybe we're far too similar. So we argue over the littlest details. We've done this for ages. Yeah, but now we know that Zora, or River Zora, and Sea Zora can get more done together. Or ha, huh, maybe what we really learned is that we got too hot during the squabble. <laughs> you two are good friends, usually. Huh? We are not. Hey, shut your gills, Inawa. Ahem, <laughs> in my case, in any case, I can't read anymore. <laughs> Allow us to express our gratitude, Zelda. We owe you a great deal. Ooh. Chief Kishara, Chief Drad, Lord Jabu Jabu has returned to Crossflow's Plaza. Yeah. Ah, let's go, Zelda. Right, it's time we celebrate. That's the least we can do to thank you. Yeah, I mean, this this was the first water temple I've seen that didn't have backtracking. So. That's nice. Would have been funny if the just started talking like with a formal British voice. It was nice to hear the Zora play the music. Could have listened to that all day. And what a perfect way for the Chiefs to make up after all of this. Right, Zelda? Where am I? You there, I need directions. Sorry, not my best manners. My name is Wright, General for the Kingdom of Hyrule. 
I found myself out at sea after regaining my senses and heard the music coming from here. Do you know the way to Hyrule Cast? Hmm, do you look a little like... No, it can't be. It's you, princess. I'd never have guessed I'd meet you here of all places. Just imagine, here in Javul Waters. Now, what in the world has been going on? <laughs> what? I can't believe all that happened while I was gone. And so, Minister Left is at this Lewberry person's home right now. That my first order of business is speaking with Minister Left immediately. Okay. Oh, well then, where does that leave us? We took care of the ref, but didn't find your father. Zelda, maybe it's a good idea for me. Yeah, okay. This is what I mean. It's just like, you finish something and then it goes, yeah, go here. Okay, now go here. Alright, now that we've done that, go here. It's just... I wish it did less of it. Alright, I'm gonna explore this area out, because I really didn't do anything here. I need to figure out how these blocks actually work. He's so angry looking. He's <laughs> got that permanent scowl. I don't understand what I've done to make this block stay, but then... Or is it because it's too close to the waterfall? It's alright, I'll just use beds. There's still a lot to do here. There's probably heart pieces and stuff I haven't gotten. Oh, it's the nut guy. Eh. <laughs> I'll do it later. I don't think it gives heart pieces. I think it's just crafting materials, which I'm all right. That works. Okay. That's so I don't I don't get why it doesn't work sometimes. It's gotta be because it's too close to the waterfall, but then... This one's right next to it and it works fine. There it goes again. Seems to be weirdly selective of when it works. Don't understand the Lost Woods area. I haven't been to that part yet. I do like that the map has familiar parts to it. Oh, 
Ciao, a qua. This makes me miss heart pieces. I hope 3D Zelda gets them back. Like, I get that um, spirit orbs are, like, functionally the same, but they just don't feel as exciting. What am I doing here? Um, I'm probably at the highest point here. I don't think there's anywhere else to go. Yeah, this looks about as high as I can go. I imagine there's another stamp out in the ocean, because I haven't really gone out there either. Oh wait, over here? <laughs> the water block is pretty cool. I heard that a rift really roughed up this little area here. I'm glad it's back to normal though. It's my all-time favorite place to take a nap. Did I buy the expensive accessories? I bought the flipper. They don't seem to really do that much. The kind of uh, underwhelming for what they cost. But, I mean, what else would I do with the money, <laughs> other than spend it on potions, which I'm not really using? This is the edge of the map. Gonna explore around here. Oh, wait, what is this? I guess that goes down, not up. Oh, 
Oh, wait, I've been here. What? Oh, this is why we rescued the kid, isn't it? I just didn't recognize it because the rift wasn't there. Hey! Out of the way. My bad. Ah, there we go. That's all of them. Oh! <laughs> this character looks so weird. Hi and howdy, stamp guy here. I've loved stamps since I was an ETBT guy. Now I'm Hyrule's greatest expert. You filled up another card. Here's your next reward as promised. You've got a knack for stamps. Who knew you'd already rally through two cards? Mm. What joy, I'm truly moved. I feel like I should spill all the secrets of my past. Hmm? Uninterested? I thought you'd be stamping your feet to learn all about it. Stop. Then on to the next card. The Thrilling Stamp. This is the stamp wielded by stamp rally experts. It is printed on quality paper that highlights the ink beautifully. Okay, all together now. Ready, set, go stamp rally. More stamps are out there waiting for you, and another reward too. Wowie. This character just feels like a Rick and Morty character. Ooh, -wee, it's time to go collect more stamps. You gotta go around the world and collect these stamps for me. Wowie. <laughs> you can do it. Here's the stamp card. Oh boy, you got all the stamps. Ooh-wee. I'm gonna give you some eggs. All right now, go get more stamps. <laughs> Especially the way he moves around. I don't know, I just got Rick and Morty vibes from it. Stamps are a joy. You don't understand the appeal of Rick and Morty, you're just a hater. Uh, I mean... To each their own. I don't watch it as much as I used to. But you know, once upon a time, people were saying they don't understand the appeal of South Park. Never watched it. It's alright. It's definitely got a bit of lol random humor, but then there's other things that... That's not so much that, it's like very sarcastic. It's okay to not enjoy that. Maybe this is better. Did that shark just crash Bandicoot spin? <laughs> the Simpsons is the best show ever made. If you take the first few seasons of it, I kind of agree, but if you take it as like, you give it a score based on the entirety, it, 
the later seasons kind of um, reduce the total score of the show, in my opinion. I mean, supposedly it's ended now, right? Like, I, th I think they had the series finale a couple days ago. What's this? There's like a ship here. It's hard to do an animated show that's still funny. For decades. I think a show that's done a good job at remaining funny is It's Always Sunny in Philly. South Box being hit and miss. American Dad is funny. American Dad's good. I enjoy American Dad. More than Family Guy. Family Guy is funny, but sometimes it just gets too random for its own good. <laughs> Love it, de las manos, yeah. That, that was a good episode. I like the one where, like, they're doing a montage and they have September by Earth, Wind, and Fire playing. And then Stan's, like, tied to a chair and he's singing the song and he's like, wait, why am I singing this? <laughs> Is lava tape wash? Yeah, it's wash your hands. That's what. That's what the guys. Well, he's he's saying that. Lava tape las manos. There's a cave here. Hang on, what is this? Yeah, he he thinks it's a Harry Potter thing. It's funny. It does sound like it. Ooh. Ice ones? No, they're water. The episode where Stan gets mad cow disease is hilarious. <laughs> the good one. I like the one where they're trying to prevent each other from crying, like no crying allowed. And they're trying to make Steve cry, that's funny. And Haley's breaking out into song to make <laughs> to make Steve cry. And instead of stopping her, Stan joins her. I resummon no more fire. This is, this is a bad thing that's happening right now. I guess we'll say hey.
Hmm? Or is it the opposite? Okay, it's the opposite. I'll have to watch that again at some point. It's been ages since I've seen American Dad. Oh, there's like a bottom right corner. What the hell? Steve's robbery episode with Roger. I don't remember that one. I like the, the whole wheels and the leg man thing they did. No, nah, I don't think I've seen the Ocean's Eleven parody one. Well, this definitely feels familiar. This is like a link to the past, Central Island thing. So there's bound to be something here. Ah, oh, it's still the fairy fountain. Are you the one that woke me up, dear? Hmm. Let's have a look at you. Yes, I don't know who you are or where you're from, but you're a diamond in the rough. Yeah. And with just a bit of polish, you could be a diamond with the stuff. Hmm. But what approach to take? Hmm. <laughs> I've got it. What if I increase the number of accessories you can wear? Yes. <gasps> How can I refuse your most heartfelt wish to be more stylish? But I won't insult you by doing it for free, of course. Oh, no, no, insult me all you want. The trouble with a free service is you're always waiting for the bill. No. I don't believe in waiting, so I always collect my fees in advance. That's fine, hundred's not bad. Well, this would have been useful sooner. Yeah, I haven't seen that episode then. <laughs> Your accessory limit has been raised by one. Now go out into the world and show off your accessories. Make me more stylish. 200 now? 300. A four rupees shot. Where is the fairy? Bottom right corner. If you're familiar with the, the lake from A Link to the Past, you'll know where it is. Zelda is a princess, isn't she rich? Well, she's currently exiled because her father has been taken hostage by the Shadow Realm, you know? So I imagine she doesn't have access to the, uh, the treasury. She's cut off currently. Just make sure you have money. Four hundred if you want it twice. Oh yeah, I can finally do this. 
Stop. What are you doing? <laughs> Stay. There we go. I don't want milk. Give me money. <laughs> or, or, uh, like a heart piece. Who the heck puts milk in a treasure chest and then seals off the entrance to the cave? Sell smoothies, or I can cut grass. That's how you got Sydney rich? What, selling smoothies or cutting grass? Speaking of Sydney, if you remember that TV show Pizza it used to be on in the early 2000s, this is like talking to the Aussies, <laughs> but um, the creator uploaded all the episodes to YouTube. So that's like a blast from the past. I got reminded of it because Sydney, you know, and that show was set in Sydney. What is Windows alerting me of? Oh, okay. Drive space, that's fine. I gotta move my VODs after this. It'll, it'll last. Well, now the accessories are useful now that I can wear multiple. I can wear three. Okay, so I imagine the next threshold is like 500 or something. Um, well, see, now I can do this. Yeah, I got eight rupees, but what what am I going to use it on? <laughs> this is going to be what I use all my money on. Oh. I guess we're doing this. Where the fuck did I get a Zora scale? The hard work and perseverance. I hear that reading. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. Um. There's a there's a side quest in the Zora vi the River Zora Village. Just go to the River Zora Village. There's like a hut. There's a kid outside, and the kid's worried that his parent is like doing something weird with monsters. And then you got to show monsters to um the parent. And once you show all the ones they're asking for, you got the scale as a reward. This is a cool area, this is new. But I guess it wants me to go to the house. I've I've gotten the thing. Let's go to the house. See, if you read <laughs> you might have yourself a Zora scale.
reading got me the Zora scale, and now reading has gotten me multiple accessories. Welcome back, princess. I imagine you've got a lot to catch up on. Go on, then. So despite mopping up those rifts, there's still no sign of the king or link. Alas, my king, where could you be? Your persistence has paid off, princess. Thank you for taking care of those rifts. That leaves but one large rift, the one located in Hyrule Castle. Ah, right. That's the one that took these two as well as his majesty. Our magnanimous king is in a rift even now. And while we stand here yammering away, those frauds are waltzing around the castle. General Wright, calm yourself. Princess, Mr. Lewberry, minister left? As Hyrule's general, I cannot stand idly by. What is it you intend to do then? Take action, obviously. I'm going to expose the true identities of those imposters tainting our beloved castle. Charge! Wait, General Wright, for the love of... Yeesh. We weren't even done talking. That guy can't sit still for long, can he? Well, back to it. You mentioned you've yet to find Link. I hope he's alright. So I'm guessing you'll head to the castle too, then. Those fakes are after your head. Princess, so... Please proceed with the utmost caution. Can listen to you reading on Audible. Well, we'd need to know what it, what to look for. Oh, I just realized this thing this thing has a face. Look at it. <laughs> um. Right, I have a bow. I forgot about that. I'll we'll just do this. I've I've been avoiding using the Link power, because I, I firmly believe that we, you, we can do this without transforming into Link too much. Well, I mean, the book would be adult in nature, so you know. If you're into that. Probably wouldn't be my thing, but if there's like a preview, a morbid curiosity at least. I wish we could use this bomb. Maybe we can. I love these signs, by the way. Kind of reminds me of One Piece. <laughs> it's like a joke in One Piece where one of the characters' wanted poster gets messed up and it, the drawing looks very similar to that. I mean, feel free to drop the title if you want. So what, what am I going to say? <laughs> that even matters. Then again, most people like... I don't really mention that I stream to many. I mean, people figure it out eventually, but... 
part of me is like, hmm, you know, if they learnt some of the horrific noises and things that I talk about here, <laughs> they might see me differently, but that's just a paranoia. I don't think they would. Can I do this yet? Right, there was this. Oop. Yeah, good. I mean, I know there's a heart piece here, I'm just not sure I can get it yet. Okay, I remember this. I don't think what I tried to do worked. So what on earth do you do here? Okay, that at least lets me access it like this. There's gotta be another entrance. Ooh. Very smart. That guy's of wisdom. <laughs> yep. Yep. Emphasis on wisdom. <laughs> Still not any clearer how to get that. It looked. Okay, it looks like there's another entrance somewhere. I'm gonna go look around. Yes. So, I mean, it should be in proximity to this. Clever. Okay. Which means this is gonna be a thing. <laughs> it's gonna be a thing. I'm gonna have to look for tunneling spots. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. That's pretty clever. I wouldn't have been able to get it before because I didn't have the mole power at that point, so. Alright, let's go here. Why won't you believe me? Look at me, listen to me, behold me. Clearly you can see that I'm your general. <sighs> it's just as I said, general, the imposters have taken control of our kingdom. The king told us to be on the lookout for imposters like you wandering around. If you're the real deal, then tell me the password. You should know it unless you're bluffing. The password? 
That's right, the king said a password. If you're who you say you are, then you'll know it. I see. Clearly the fraudulent king is trying to frame us as the imposters. This is preposterous. Those frauds have outmaneuvered us. They're the real left and right. But these people think they're imposters. This is kind of a mess. All right, listen up. The king, general, and minister in the castle are fakes, frauds, phonies. <laughs> general Wright, let's revise our strategy. They certainly won't believe us now. But if I can just... Huh? The rift! No, oh, no, the castle town. The rift that's pulled people in. What should we do now? Pull it together! Huh? You are soldiers of Hyrule. Those soldiers, what is your duty? To, to protect the people. Correct. You know your duty well. Now then, brave soldiers of Hyrule... Guide all of those who are fleeing to safety. I'll seek anyone else who's been left behind. Together we will protect our people. Hi. Yes, sir. <coughs> this is terrible. Princess, you're the only one who can mend the rift. Please rescue those who have been taken. I'll help with the evacuation. All right. Hang on. Maybe it's below us. Found it. There's a place below where I should be able to create an entrance to the rift. Let's make our way underground. See, I was going to try and find it myself, but okay. Oh, you can't go through there. <laughs> I love just throwing the dog at them. This one is still the best summon. It just knocks them back and then they can't do anything. Guess we're going in the well.
Oh. This looks so creepy. <laughs> Good. See how the block works now. You can just kind of throw it anywhere. It's just weird that in the river it doesn't seem to work consistently. Bad idea, isn't it? What? Wait. Oh, oh, damn it. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Okay, that's better. It's fine. That can be accessory money. This is not gonna work, is it? Nah, not even close. <laughs> okay. Did that, but that, but what? Did I screw myself over by coming here? No, no, no. Think about it. Think about it. I know what I need to do. Yep. Come here. Now. I keep forgetting this is a thing. I don't know why I'm doing this. I don't, I don't, I don't think this is a thing. Oh, maybe. Hang on. I mean, it's cool that it lets you, but I don't think this is anything. Something about this feels even worse than what we've dealt with before. Zelda, let's be extra careful. So this is probably right before it opens up to, like, more dungeons.
Just why why is this one the best? <laughs> I have yet to find one that is as useful as this one. This is cool. So your father was here all along. Don't worry, Zelda. Once we mend the rift, he'll go back to normal. Nice little nod to a link to the past. Here, okay. This is like the start of the game. Uh oh, that's not gonna work. <laughs> Doggo! Oh, can I not? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, this is supposed to be a start. Okay. Well, now I know. Yeah, I, I didn't realize it was going to make me do this again. Oh, that one sees me. Yeah, I'm just going to water block my way <laughs> through this. Uh, go water block. This is definitely one of the more useful echoes. What is okay? <laughs> Physics? Uh oh. Oh no 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 <laughs> shit. Puts me back at the start. Oh, good. Checkpoint. Alright, there's a checkpoint at least.
Not so fast. <laughs> Water block. Oh, it's Impa. She got thrown in jail. Hey, she's she's the one who helped you escape from the dungeon. The rift took her too. So we'll be back to normal soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh? What's this? After the princess escaped from the castle, I was captured by the soldiers and thrown into a cell. I was outnumbered, I did what I could, but in the end I succumbed to them. I keep hearing people shouting, find her, find the princess from the halls. Which means that she is still safe, she has not yet been found. At least I can take solace in that. The soldiers spoke of a rift disappearing, being mended. The princess must have managed this. Yet I worry, is she injured? Is she overextending herself for the sake of the kingdom? I am frustrated here in this cell being unable to do anything but pray for her safety. The castle is in an uproar. Could something have happened to the princess, or could the enemy be making a move? I must find a way out of here so I can warm the pr uh, warn the princess, jeez. Midnight brain. Can't read. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, you can do this? I forgot you could do this. I mean, land from a, from above. Oh, all right. Think, there we go. <laughs> it can't. It can't hurt me. We have the high ground. It's over. This one's worth two. This will still work. Good. Oh, oh, they can they can get rid of the water. Okay, maybe my my strategy isn't as brilliant as I thought. I mean, it's still pretty good. Get him, doggo! Alright. Doesn't work. Again, just... This one is clearly the best.
That is cool, though, that you can give yourself high ground like that. I don't know what I was thinking with that. It's fine. Let it do its thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. I was wondering why they weren't lighting the torch. This actually isn't that bad. Whoops. <laughs> Let me try something. Does... Okay, it does. <laughs> I was like, does it stop you? That's cool. You can use the bed... You can use the water block and the bed in a combination move. Check this out. It's a neat little elevator. Combinations are cool. No doubt about that. What is this here? Hmm. I guess they're just decorative.
These ones are too aggressive. You need to bait it to jump this way. It's got more of that. See, this is a hard requirement for this. Otherwise, I wouldn't be using it. This is correct. Oh boy. Yay, more stealth. the control. They didn't see me. I wonder if there's anything... Okay, that probably is. Let's just do this first. I feel like I'm repeating. Oh, what the... It's the same car at all. Okay, I'm going back. Yeah. 
might get an echo of that. That seems useful. That just seems useful to be able to push enemies off stuff. And also for gliding. Okay, that didn't work nearly, <laughs> nearly as well as I wanted it to. Hang on. Come here. Bat. Doesn't let me grab it. Ah, damn it. All right, I tried. I wanted to go right. I forgot about Spiderweb. Again. I feel like there could have been a better way to do this. Why am I not making this work? Okay. It's fine. Dude. Oh, come on! Oh, I don't know how to control this. Why doesn't it make a web... Now it did. I don't get it, what's the difference? Like, I'm cast- oh, it's so jank! Why does it work sometimes and sometimes it doesn't? Okay, that worked. That worked. Alright, it's fine. See, this is a way I could have gotten across without resorting to that. Okay, give me a minute. I wasn't kidding, it's like basically a minute.
This one's probably going to be cool. Uh, but then again, it does take a, a while for it to wind up. <laughs> she needs a beauty sleep. I can throw it at it. What did I what did I say? I mean uh, like I miss heart pieces being available in dungeons. Oh, this is... Okay, I know where I am now. Frog ring. Enables a... Okay, that one is going on right now. It's more useful than this. Ah. Oh. That is extremely useful. Oh, the music's changed. It's gotten more serious. <laughs> One more time. My dear daughter, you have done well to make it here. You've worked tirelessly to mend quite a few rifts. I find that vexing. So I will put an end to you. I will use my master's power to be rid of you once and for all. Oh. I figured. It's that blue monster. I thought Link defeated it. No, that isn't the same monster that Link defeated. The power used to create this monster is the same as the power we use to create Echoes. This monster is an Echo. I am Ganon, the Demon King who reigns over the darkness of this world. No one can defeat me. Crumble to dust in the wake of my dark power. I think this is like a hard requirement.
Oh, damn. These bats again. Go, Peter. this shit. No, we have to do this now. Okay, this is not... Damn it. Too close. Oh my god, I'm so bad at that. It's not over yet. I don't have enough hero power to do this. Oh. Changes that. <laughs> the P out one. That's kind of funny. All I do is get him to focus on me. Oh, it didn't work. There we go, there we go. Focus on me. Dummy. <laughs> I don't have to do that rebound thing if I don't want to. Ooh. 
Ooh. That was stupid. Get him, P-Hot. <laughs> you can totally win without using the Link power. My friends shared some of their power with me. That's... That's it. Okay, five. What can you do now? Cost reduction. It's interesting how P-Hat is not reduced in cost yet. <laughs> I think we all know which one's the best echo. So that blue monster was an echo. Wonder if that means there's something else capable of using the same power as I have. Do you think all the monsters that have been capturing me and my friends were echoes too? It's all pretty confusing right now. I'm sorry I don't know more Zelda. I want to figure it out, but your father comes first. With the rift gone, he should be safe now. So let's get out of here now, yeah? Oh. Right. This is what Act 2 begins, I guess. Wait, is that the real Link? Oh, he's been putting it. <laughs> wow. Like the opposite of what happens in A Link to the Past. Did he have a club? Am I imagining things, or was he using, like, a club? <laughs> like a wooden mace? That was Link, the real Link, I'm sure of it. Did he get captured or something? What should we do, Zelda? Oh. <laughs> Zelda! Where? Where am I? The castle, everything feels hazy. Ah, I recall it now. I was pulled into a rift. <laughs> ah, my dear daughter. You saved me, thank you. What has happened to Iral in my absence? Ah, <clears throat> uh, I see. You have put your own safety at risk. You have done so to protect our people, to save Hyrule. Zelda, my brave and selfless daughter. I'm so very, very proud of you. Well done. Your Majesty. Are you alright? Halt, intruder. Stand down, soldiers. Have a closer look. It is my daughter, Zelda. Princess Zelda? But Princess Zelda was the one creating the rifts, wasn't she? My daughter creating rifts? It seems the imposter posing as me has spread some damaging untruths. Ooh. I will clear up the misunderstandings. Please go rest for now. 
You have done well. Thank you, Zelda. That's not the real Emperor, is it? Master Try. I find it interesting that I can see you now where I was not able to before. Ah, and I know that the princess has been safe because she had you as her guide. So now that I can see you, I can say this to your face. Thank you for everything. I've been wondering for a while, what does thank you mean? Everyone keeps saying it to Zelda. Oh well, it's an expression of gratitude. I've been both happy and relieved that you have aided the princess. So to express that feeling of gratitude, I say thank you. Hmm, I'm only helping Zelda so I can get rid of the rifts. But I'm glad you're happy. Already waking up then, princess? You appear well. I'm glad to see it. Try told us everything about how you faced extreme evil, putting yourself in peril. All to save us, to save your kingdom. You pushed yourself, princess, but now you are safe. I think about how small you once were and how I look at you now. Oh, how you have grown. Ah, uh, there I go, getting myself all worked up again. I am so very overjoyed to see you again, princess. Well, my apologies for disturbing you so soon after waking, but I bring a message from the king. He requests you come to the throne room once you are fully rested. I will go on ahead. We'll be waiting for you. Oh, there's the bed upgrade. There we go. <laughs> no more. Oh, but it costs more. I guess this is a healing bed. Okay, I thought it was going to replace the other one as far as navigation goes, but th that makes sense. Now we have a healing bed. Still not going to replace this one for perversion, but that's fine. Ah, oh, Zelda, I trust you got some rest. Now then, we are all here. It is time for us to discuss next steps. Try informed us earlier about what is occurring in Hyrule. Through your hard work and determination, the large rifts have been tended to. Still, peace has not been restored to Hyrule. There is work yet to be done. Right, the Ganon we fought beneath the castle was an Echo. He was created. So it's possible that the monsters that captured my friends were also Echoes like Ganon. Initially, I deduced that everything had been at the hands of that monster, Ganon. That following Link's defeat of Ganon, we were seeing the after-effects of their battle. But try, you believe we may have been facing a different enemy all along? And Link saved Zelda from this mysterious foe. But then Link was captured. Oh, Link, I hope you are safe. Your Majesty! Large rifts are opening all across Hyrule again. Three of them at once this time. No. Where are these rifts appearing? They have appeared in Elden Volcano, Farron Wetlands, and Holy Mount Lanaru Sire. Elden, Farron, and Lanaru, I wonder. Considering those locations, then could it be? What is it, Sire? Those regions connect directly with the Prime Energy. With the what now? The Prime Energy, a source of power beyond our understanding, left behind by the goddesses. The knowledge of its existence has been passed down through the royal family since long ago. Those three regions connect to the three goddesses and in turn to the Prime Energy. It's as though the rifts are targeting those areas very specifically. This might mean the rifts aren't natural occurrences but are being created by someone. That's impossible! But then, if that's true, the Prime Energy could end up with the enemy. There are yet more legends passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. When evil strives for the Prime Energy, a wise priestess and a courageous hero will appear. Together, the priestess and the hero will rend this evil asunder. A priestess and a hero. 
Zelda has gotten rid of many rifts. Could Zelda be the priestess of legend? She. She must be. Perhaps it is the swordsman Link. Eh? Come to think of it, Zelda mentioned that Link's able to move even while in the still world. He's also been fighting the enemy all on his own. If Link is the hero, then that means both the priestess and the hero have indeed appeared. True, but Link has been captured by the enemy. Zelda. Mend the three rifts in the regions connected to the goddesses. This will thwart our enemy. In order to stop the enemy completely, however, you must do even more than that. You have to find the hero Link, and the two of you must join forces, fighting together. My daughter, I have only and ever wished for a peaceful life for you. But it seems that fate has other plans. You are the priestess of legend, the hope of Hyrule. We will do everything in our power to support you on this most dire journey. Minister Left, you are to continue working with Luberry, monitoring the rifts. General Right, lead your soldiers to contend with the monsters across Hyrule. Yes, your majesty. Impa, it is time. Provide Zelda with the garments. I will do so with haste, sire. Come with me, princess. Oh, Princess, these clothes suit you well. Oh. oh. These are your ancestral vestments passed down through the royal family. They will be perfect for your needs as you continue your quest. Ooh. I imagine the enemy's ultimate aim is to obtain the prime energy. We do not yet know the enemy's true nature, but I fear that Hyrule is in grave danger. As a leader of Hyrule and the Priestess of Legend, please do what you must to protect our kingdom. Cool outfit. Alright, that is the stopping point for tonight. We'll continue this next time. Yeah, this was, uh, Echoes of Wisdom. It was fun. Um, yeah, thank you for tuning in if you're watching this later as a replay. Hope you enjoyed, and if you want to support the channel, just click the like button, it helps a lot. But we'll see you next time.